Hello there, welcome to Cartooning with Paul. Today, I'm gonna show you how to draw a Roblox noob. So, let's get started. Hello there, cartooners. Welcome back to Cartooning with Paul. This past weekend, I had an impromptu and very rare meet up with a bunch of my viewers, and I wanna thank you guys so, so much. Uh, one of them is Riley, and Riley, is requesting that we draw the noob from Roblox. So here you go, Riley. Let's get started right now. Okay, so first of all, we're drawing a very uh, simplistic design here, right? The Roblox is very... Um, Roblox is successful because of its simplicity and within its simplicity, the easy gameplay. So, what we're gonna do is I've thrown in uh, like a marshmallow shape right here. This is gonna be for the head. And the body is really like a box shape. So I'm going to throw in the top of the box, right? I'm gonna bring it down and when you draw in this box shape remember you don't have to be rigid see i'm kind of curling it in a little bit there's flexibility in these shapes so don't forget to keep them as flexible as you want so i'm going to finish in this rectangular box shape here give it a little dimension there right And now we're going to separate below there for the legs. And for right now, just for demonstrational purposes, I'm just gonna have the legs straight down, not doing anything funky, and show you just how we do this here. Now you can pose these legs however you want. Just remember that However you turn the leg, you have to give three dimensions to it. And now I'm gonna have the noob um, kind of bending his elbows on this side. So you gotta remember his arm is all one piece. So this is a very flexible rectangular cube shape, right? Uh, but what you don't want to do is stretch out the elbow so much that it doesn't work geometrically. So I'm going to maybe bring the elbow in a little bit. Oh, that's much better. Oh, you know what? While I'm thinking about it, for all of you Roblox fans, Riley actually has a YouTube channel of her own. It's called Perfectly Pickled. There's an underscore in the middle there. So it's perfectly underscore pickled. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put a link in the description so that you can click that link and go directly her, to her channel. And maybe you guys will wanna subscribe. It's actually, it's cute, it's a lot of fun. Now on this arm, let's, um, what do I wanna do with this arm? And you know what I think we're gonna do? We're gonna have him holding a soda cup. So we're going to really bend this arm. I'm just gonna give it a little bit here and then maybe we continue it up like this. I think it's gonna twist a little bit. Hopefully that does that. I'm just gonna curl it in to itself like that. And I think we can do this. So I'm gonna throw in a soda cup. I'm gonna see it from the bottom here. Yeah, I'll throw a straw in there just like that. And
And now that I get the body in, let's dive into the head. So I initially drew in that head a little, little narrow. I because I drew in quite a big quite a big body shape there. So here we go. Here is our head shape. Like I said, it's uh, it's like a marshmallow shape on the top. His eyes will go in the upper third of his head. So we're going to throw in these beady Lego like eyes and the smile is up nice and high I'm gonna give him some cheeks like this make him just look absolutely adorable and he's got some upper teeth here He's got some lower teeth here, and he has a hint of a tongue. Just like that. And I'm gonna give him a little dumbfounded look, just like that. Riley, I hope you liked this drawing. Guys, if you like this, please give the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and uh, hit that bell notification so you're aware when I drop my next video. I want to thank you guys so much for drawing with me today, and until the next video, we'll see you later.